What on earth is a bomb cyclone? This may sound a bit scary, but it actually doesn't have anything to do with what you might think. It actually stems from the word bombogenesis. This is a term used by meteorologists to describe a rapidly intensifying area of low pressure. To get that weather bomb classification, the storm must drop at least 24 millibars within 24 hours. A millibar is a measurement of atmospheric pressure. So how does this drastic change in pressure happen? Well, it's usually when a cold air mass collides with a warm air mass, and these dueling air masses can light the metaphorical fuse. Storms that go through bombogenesis occur more frequently in the Pacific, but don't rule out the Atlantic. Sometimes we see this happen with nor'easters, which can impact the entire eastern seaboard of the U.S. These storms can produce tropical storm and hurricane strength winds with heavy rain and even flooding. And in the winter, they're known to dump several feet of heavy snow and causing blizzard-like conditions. But keep in mind, not every strong storm goes through bombogenesis. Although they can happen year-round, October to March seems to be when we see this most commonly occur. While the name bomb cyclone is not the official term, it is a lot easier to say and remember and definitely gets your attention. And that's what the sign says about bomb cyclones.